A major dog show in Tulsa is about to wrap up today, and the impact it's had on some of our neighbors has been huge. Two News reporter Dan Perlman is live from the QT Event Center with what they've done. Dan? Well, guys, the show started on Friday. It's run through the weekend. It's been a chance for dog owners to show off dogs like this one right here, Miranda. At the same time, they have done so much more. Over the past four days, more than 1,600 pets have come through the doors here at the QT Event Center. I'm sure you can imagine thousands of people have also come by for the four-day all-breed dog show. Sure, this was all about the dogs here, but many people were also thinking about the dogs in tornado ravaged cities like Joplin, Piedmont, and Guthrie. So the Southern Handlers Charity League organized a raffle, silent auction, and match in which they raised more than $11,000 to help the dogs in those areas. It's an incredible feeling. You know, it was an exhausting experience to put that, all of that together and try to raise the money in a long day yesterday. But when it's all done, you really feel good that, that you were able to help somebody else. Now, the people here are still collecting money as well as supplies like food, which can go to the pets in those areas. I also want to point out this dog show has had a huge impact here in Tulsa with thousands of people coming to town. You can imagine they've spent a lot of money at area hotels and restaurants. If you want to stop by, the show will be running until probably 5 or 6 today until Best of Show is announced. It is free if you want to come. Live in Midtown with Miranda. Dan Perlman, 2 News, works for you. All right. Thank you, Dan and Miranda.